All right, check this out. This is my bubbler pond. I got bubbles. Hoo -hoo -hoo. All right, we spent most of the morning trying to get this buck converter to work. But check out this Frankenstein stuff going on here. I love this stuff. Here's the buck converter right here. I had to go into Lowe's and get some nylon standoffs right here. And right now I am charging, and I've got about 13.2 volts charging up. And the output of this buck converter is about 12 volts. It's having a booger of a time trying to figure out these potentiometers. And I'll tell you more about that later, but it's working, I think. <laughs> also got the cigarette lighter working in here. There. Barely clears right there. Hey, good morning. Doing some morning peaks and tweaks. Last night, these white LED marker lights lit up way too much. They are just stupid, stupid bright. 60 lumens is what they are rated, but they're a lot brighter than that. So I may go with a different color, something that isn't as obnoxious. But one thing I did this morning, I want to show you here. That's the actual no kidding battery voltage right there. And right here, I had the same green meter right here, and it was reading battery voltage too. Well, doesn't it make more sense to put in a meter that will read what's coming off the buck converter, which is powering this, this bus right here? The problem was the green meter is an older style meter, and it wouldn't read it. It just read 0, 0.00. It turned on, but it just didn't read anything. I pulled up my 1733 DC voltmeter Blue C systems and good to go. This right here, of course, is the solar panel. It turns off the solar panels. It turns on the solar panels. See there? Cool. And I've got the whole output of this thing, including the buck converter, on the load here. So if the voltage gets to 12 volts, it just shuts everything off anyway. And the other thing is that, that I wired these marker lights to the switch here using piggybacks. That's not a good idea. I'm going to rewire it onto the buses here. It's the same circuit, so it, this, light, this switch will still turn off the lights and everything else. So just a couple things I learned that I'd share it with you.